you talk about a fundamental, fundamentally strong fighter, always bringing his hands back to protect his chin. Even when he was knocked loopy by uh, Holyfield, even when he was loopy, he was standing there. Referee says, are you ready to continue? But his hands were up, just like this. That's fundamentally sound. That's like branded in his fucking brain to keep the hands up. That's a man with that devastating fire and all of that fucking bobbing and weeping and bending of his knees and you know, lateral movement. You know, compact design, all that fucking power and those left and right hooks, oh my god. He was a scary, he was a scary fucking dude to fight back in the day. Oh my god. I hope I get a chance to meet that guy someday. Maybe I have a fight or something, you know what I'm saying? spot in the glove where fighters grab and illegally hold the person's hand. Man, when you get your fingers in there, 
oh shit, you can just, the other girl, I can't do a fucking thing. You know, I gotta believe, if I was a fighter, I would have them seam that closed. I would have them stitch it like that, depending on my hands. See like right there? Stitch it. I, I, I would dare to say I bet those fighters do it. They have somebody seam the glove so it conforms to their hand more. Okay guys, I'm gonna shut you down. It's nice talking to you again.